PureGraph Direct Harvest is a reusable system, making it possible for the user to harvest lipoaspirate directly into the single-use PureGraph 850. The Direct Harvest system is comprised of three core products, the PureGraph Vacuum Lid, the PureGraph Easel and Slider, and a 3-liter Medela canister. Before using the PureGraph Direct Harvest system, all seven pieces must be sterilized in accordance to their instructions for use. Additional supplies that are needed for the procedure are PureGraft 850, sterilized PureGraft transfer adapter, preferred liposuction equipment, Tumi and lure lock syringes, and lactated ringers. After opening the items on the sterile field, assemble the easel and slider. Next, connect the three liter canister to the back of the easel. After opening the PureGraft 850 on the sterile field, Remove the augs and drain caps from the 850 system and carefully insert the metal drain straw into the drain port on the PureGraft 850. Now, connect the PureGraft 850 to the lid base, lock the metal slide fitting, and firmly press the tissue port of the 850 system on to its metal fitting. It is important that this port is securely seated to ensure the connection does not separate during the harvest process. Next, curl the 850 system with the blue writing facing inward and insert the bag into the canister. After this step is complete and no wrinkles are present on the bag, place the silicone cap on the waste port. Then place the liposuction tubing leading to the aspirator on the vac port and the tubing leading to the cannula on the patient port. The assembly of the direct harvest system and PureGraft 850 is now complete. Once a scrub tech is proficient, the total time needed for assembly will be about 30 seconds. During the harvesting process, the PureGraft 850 bag may expand from time to time when the cannula is removed from the patient. This is normal. As one can see, the system has been assembled properly and fluid is not leaking from the patient port. In the event the patient port was not firmly seated, turn off the aspirator, remove the lid from the canister, and firmly reattach the tissue port to the lid. Before the purification stage, it is advised that the user first remove the waste fluid by simply turning off the aspirator, moving the tubing from the vac port to the waste port, and turning on the aspirator for 10 to 15 seconds or until the desired amount of waste is removed. To estimate the total amount of lipoaspirate, utilize the scale on the back of the easel at eye level or use an instrument as shown here. Keep in mind, after removing the excess waste fluid, Final purified graft volume will be approximately 50% less. To remove the bag from the canister, first unlock the fitting on top of the lid, and then, utilizing both thumbs, release the lid from the canister. Now, unscrew and remove the drain port. Before lifting the bag from the canister, reattach the AUGS cap. Purge the air from the bag and then attach the drain bag. Attach the purification bag to the easel and place the waste bag on the floor. With the drain clamp open, the user should begin to see fluid draining into the waste bag. By now, the circulating nurse will have replaced the tumescent bag with one liter of lactated ringers, and the scrub tech can now attach the tumescent tubing to the wash port on the PureGraft 850 bag. Before adding lactated ringers, clamp the drain line and then introduce about 450 milliliters of fluid into the bag. It is advised that the pump is set to its maximum speed for the greatest efficiency. Mix the lactated ringers with a lipoaspirate for 20 to 30 seconds. Then open the drain clamp and allow the waste to drain for approximately three minutes. To expedite the drain process, continue agitating the bag. This entire process will be repeated a second time until the fat is adequately purified. If the user desires extra dry tissue, leave the drain open until the fat is close to a toothpaste-like consistency. To remove tissue from the bag, the wash and tissue ports may both be used, but utilizing the tissue port is the preferred method. Place the syringe in the tissue port and aspirate while pressing the tissue towards the port with the slider. If the surgeon desires to inject the fat with a lure lock syringe, utilize the PureGraft adapter as shown to facilitate the transfer of tissue. After the case is complete, the disposable items can be thrown away and all seven reusable items can be sent to sterilization, making sure the silicone cap is not disposed.